Platelet disorders can be inherited or acquired one. In most of the cases, it is the acquired one, like in the case of Roger. Roger is a five-year-old boy who was brought to hospital by his mother. He presented with a new onset of swear bruising on his legs. On asking, his mother could not recall any history of falls or bumps that might have caused the bruising. So at first, there is no clue in the history. Moving on to physical examination, mucosal bleeding was seen in the oral cavity. Questioning revealed that Roger had flu-like symptoms few weeks earlier, so that might be a viral infection. Rest of the examination was normal, only finding is the bleeding. The history, there is no history of the bleeding disorders as well. So for making the diagnosis easier, a complete blood count of Roger was taken. Everything was normal except the platelet count, that was 26,000 per microliter. Now, how, how will you diagnose such patient? What disease your patient is suffering from and what treatment option you will opt for this? It will be easier to answer all of these questions if you have a thorough understanding of platelet disorders. Cardio.com is bringing a complete lecture of 40 minutes on platelet disorders along with short clips and videos. So you can watch these videos and lecture to solve these case studies. Simply go to this cardio.com, subscribe and get a free trial of two days.